I lost every bit of confidence in myself and it, it's already hard because personally I'm I'm not someone who naturally has confidence because I don't think anyone's born with it. You have to believe in yourself and do I? <laughs> My name is Nsikwet and I'm an actor. I'm sure people probably think they know everything. Well, because most times you're forced to say things about yourself even when you don't want to. I had a medical condition, so it happens. And then you, you know, I went on a hiatus for five years. Who does that? Some balls they say. I didn't want to do it, but it happened. I lost every bit of confidence in myself and it, it's already hard because personally I'm I'm not someone who naturally has confidence because I don't think anyone's born with it. You have to believe in yourself and do I? <laughs> I don't think so. I struggle like any other person. So after the five year hiatus, <laughs> I wasn't getting callbacks. I am... Um, I'd spoken to my manager, that's my team, my family. Was it worth coming back? Was it, would I be able to face the pressure? And yes, I came back. I was on every audition list. No brands wanted to touch me. Nobody wanted to be around me. And that's fair. It is fair. What changed it for me was I, I got a few calls, but then there was an audition I had, and it was seven months after. I remember my, um, my manager kept saying, it would be really be nice if you made it. And I said, I always fail auditions. I'm not good at them. I'm, I'm horrible. I'm scared. I don't believe in myself. I don't think my talent is enough. I don't think, I don't get callbacks. And that's okay, but after five years, you don't expect to get a call back. I felt washed up. I felt like the washed up talent who will never make it. And bang. Kemi Aditiba calls me. <laughs> yeah. That meant something. And so, did I start to believe? Not yet. I was, I had panic attacks every day on set. And she held my hand. I'm grateful for the chances that other people have taken on me. Confidence, it's not something you're born with. It, 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 it's, you'll get scared and fear is good, I think. Fear means you care. Fear shows that you believe in something. You're afraid of failing. And my fear drives me. My vulnerability drives me. But I'm thankful that in it all, I find balance. In it all, I steal my mind through meditation. I've got family that loves me. God, I've got family that loves me. And that's my backbone. And then, I, I guess I am thankful for my fans as well, because I think my fans give me confidence. And that's the truth. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not swayed or I don't care about the hype. I care about the work. So whatever it is you do, no matter how hard you think it is, no matter how tough, your life might be, no matter the cards that you've been dealt, no matter how many lemons you get. <laughs> yeah, I know, if kids are watching this, not a gin and tonic, that's for the adults, you make lemonade. <laughs> Loads of sugar, but just a tiny bit a bit. But yeah, that's it. And then you say to yourself, I'll have the drink and I'll try again.
no one's counting, no one's waiting to see who wins first, no one's, no one's, no one's, and even if they are, turn out the noise, it's really just forget about it really, it really doesn't matter, what matters is if you're happy, and in it all you must, you must, you must, you must love everyone you come across, regardless of who they are. <laughs> Hey sis, could you relate to this story? Stand a chance to win some amazing prizes and have your story featured by submitting an audio recording, telling us about a moment in your life you lost self-confidence, regained it, and what you learned in the process. Visit www.confidentdarling.com for more details on how to enter and share your moment story. I'm asking and hoping that you 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 share your stories because I've just shared my moment and something that I, I held dear to my heart and I never really spoke about. So I'm asking that you, you share your story so you can encourage other people.